Hey ladies, my name is Amaya Desire. I'm from Big Go Belt Media. Um, congratulations on, on the show, Queen's Court, and also on taking the leap um, into love again. Um, how are you all feeling today? Great. Tired. Amazing. <laughs> yeah, right. Amazing. No, the mm-hmm. truth is I haven't had any time with these girls since we right, stopped right. filming. <laughs> And um, it's been an amazing um, day of reflection, number one, and just um, getting the chance to catch up with what happened with our lives after we finished taping. And so I love these ladies. These ladies will always be um, a part of my life and a good friend of mine. No, really, because we Mm -hmm. we bonded Mm -hmm. um, while we were shooting the show because we all came in to the house with this wanting the same result and that is to find our person wanted to find love and when you can go into a situation with someone who has the same intent as you who can also be supportive it just makes that situation that much better Better. Mm -hmm. yes right i totally understand well i'll i'll give you guys a simple question i'll start with you evelyn um tell me what made you really want to go into experience of course we're all like looking for love right but like what made you decide that you want to gonna because you're gonna date multiple men at one time so yeah what made you want to do this well because i was single for a couple of years <laughs> and yeah. i said to myself you know what if i don't do this where am i gonna find him you know yeah. i wanted to take a leap of faith i wanted to open up my heart I wanted to, you know, I just went into, you know, when this came across to me, I was like, okay, this sounds good. This feels good. I didn't know what it was going to be. Yeah. And where do you get to meet 21 guys at one time? You know, and from what I know, they really seek them out and they did, you know, all these checks. And and so I felt confident doing it. And then I found out that these two ladies were going (laughs) to do it. And I was like, oh, okay, this could be an amazing thing. So um, I have zero regrets. I will say that it was interesting. <laughs> Dating right. three guys, going on three dates, having right. three yeah. conversations. Okay. You know, and then when it starts getting serious, things are getting competitive and it's just like, okay, mm-hmm. you're getting pulled here this way. But um, it was a good experience and um, a little crazy at times, but you know, <laughs> right. I'm, I'm, I have zero well, re- regrets. <laughs> I was able to watch a few episodes and I got to say it's it was a lot different than what I expected. Right? Really? Of course, I'm, I'm slightly younger than you all, but the dating world and the dating shows are like, for me, they're just, you can't, you, they, you don't see the genuineness, you don't see mm. the authenticity. And then for me in this show, I did. Um, so Nivia, I'll have a, I'll ask a question for you because you guys are dating multiple men at one time. Would you advise women who are single looking to do what you guys did on this show in the real world? I actually would. I've Mm -hmm. never dated that many men at at the same time. And I wouldn't maybe necessarily advise 21 men, (laughs) but I would say do a small little group because Mm -hmm. if you are like, I feel like us doing this show was making it intentional that this is what we want in in our lives. So I think by doing that, you set the tone that I'm being, I'm actively seeking this or willing it into my life. And um, you leave, you kind of get it out of the way. You like, Right, they, right. The, yeah. At the same time, like, why would you wait? And if that doesn't work out, now you got to start all over again. Like we said, it's a lot of work, though. A lot of the same mm-hmm. questions you're going to ask people and vice versa. But I, at this age, I'm trying to hurry up and, and, and make it happen, baby. There. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, I, I'm not, I'm not going to ask you how old you are because we all know that black don't crack. But I will say <laughs> that my dad is actively calling me with ingredients to put into my smoothie in order to find a man and get pregnant. So oh, I can only oh, imagine, oh. <laughs> you know. Come but, on, dad. Um, I say, Come daddy, daddy. got to be a witch doctor. <laughs> yeah, dad is a vegan. So, you know, this is just who he is. Okay. <laughs> Tamar, my question for you would be, did you find your yourself dating outside of the box more than you dated um the people you were most comfortable with Mm. um what i am going to say is that i've i've found that i challenged myself a lot Mm. because Mm. going into this i was very shallow and i thought that i was completely ready and open and i wasn't as open as i thought you know you never really know how are you going to react in a situation until the situation presents itself? And 21 men, a lot of a lot of women might be excited about dating 21 men, but I was not excited about that. Like, right. I, I, I thought it was a lot of pressure. I thought it was a lot of work. And um, I don't know. I, I think at the end of the day, I learned that it's okay to take my time. 
And it's okay to definitely check in with myself to make sure that the person that I'm going out with is checking all of the boxes and it's worth my time because I'm not here to waste my time. And so I just wanted to make sure that, you know, I just wasn't stuck on one type of a man. I had to explore and open my eyes to different things to get a different result. Mm -hmm. Right. Well, ladies, I just want to say that I'm excited to watch the rest of the season. As somebody who is in the dating world, it really actually gives me hope because, Aww, listen, it is. it's rough out here. Amy, but, girl. Um, it is. It is. <laughs> but some of the questions that you all ask, some of the, you know, the dates that you all go on definitely gives me ideas. So mm. I can't wait to see what the rest of the season looks Aww. like. Congrats, Lynn. Again, um, I don't know what the ending is, so right. I'm hoping that I get some good some good news, but we'll see. Thank you guys so much. Thank, Thank you. you. Bye.